What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. Today's video is a super impromptu one. I actually went to the grocery store to pick up a few things um, that I needed for my class because we're making bread and we're making sourdough like pre-ferments at home. But they didn't have it and I was gonna go to this place called Bulk Barn. Basically bulk goods that are sold by like grams so they're like really big buckets full of um various products and you would just like uh, pick it up according to the gram weight or something like that so bulk barn actually does have the bread flour that i'm looking for so i thought since i'm gonna head to bulk barn anyways might as well take y'all along and show y'all what bulk barn is and then do like a mini bulk barn haul at the end of it so i'm just gonna go walk to my train and i'll see y'all at bulk barn So I just got back from Bulk Barn and ouch I just grabbed like on my hair but yeah that's my bag and it's so full I'm gonna put it down it's been so heavy carrying this around but yeah let's do a Bulk Barn haul. Okay so before we move on to the haul part of this uh, video I'm gonna first pull up the definition of Bulk Barn and tell y'all what Bulk Barn is because I need to get this right in order for y'all to understand but basically Bulk Barn is Canada's largest bulk food retailer and so basically everything is in really big bins like y'all just saw in the previous clips and you just scoop out how much ever you want you put it into a small plastic uh, packet and then you only pay for how many ever grams that you've taken um, this is the first time I went to Bulk Barn. I've heard so much about Bulk Barn, but weirdly, I haven't gone to Bulk Barn before. Basically, I'm sold. I love Bulk Barn. This is my new favorite place. So now that we've explained what Bulk Barn is and we've got that out there, I am going to proceed to the haul part of this. So, so the first thing that I got is like a small packet of all-purpose flour. And this is basically, I'm going to make pasta and a couple of sauces and I just need like a really little um, flour to like thicken the sauces but I don't want to buy like a whole kg of maida or whatever so I just got a small packet of all-purpose flour. Next thing that I got is some pasta seasoning. This is like mixed Italian seasoning and this is just for like pastas and sandwiches and basically everything that I need Italian seasoning for. Like I mentioned you can pick up really small quantities that way you don't waste a lot of things. You also like cut down on your cost and um, you can go and get fresh uh, products as and when you need it. So I just got a small packet of pasta seasoning. Next thing that I got is the thing that I went to a bulk barn for. This is bread flour. This is unbleached bread flour. And I basically need this for pastry school because we're actually making our very own sourdough ferment, like a sourdough starter because we're going to be making sourdough bread. So we have to make the starter and we have to like take care of it and feed it like a certain amount of water and flour every day. So I needed some flour for that. That's the reason I went to Bulk Barn in the first place. Um, the next thing that I got are these small, like, and like, I think they're called animal biscuits or something. All the kids in India, y'all know this because we used to get this at Nilgiris. I forgot what it's called, but I know that all Indian kids will know what this is. Like, we've had this when we were kids. I just cannot remember the name. But 
um you will know if you know what i'm talking about if you know what these are called in india leave it in the comments down below cuz i can't for the love of god um remember what these are called the next thing that i got are these um dark chocolate covered almonds these dates they're like pitted dates and i also got some almonds so what i'm basically going to do is put like an almond inside each date and like eat it as a snack and put it into my school bag because i do tend to get really hungry at college and i don't want to be wasting like 2 dollars every time i get hungry at college um so i'm just going to make a few snacks on the go and take them in my bag so that way when i get hungry during lectures i have something to snack on second last thing that i got are some raisins these were some south african i don't know they were like basically sour raisins if you know me you know i love everything that's sour this metal straws they're so nice this one is like holographic and this one's just like a plain one and i wanted one for the house like for my room and one to just keep in my bag cuz save turtles so i ended up getting these two metal straws and i think they were only like 99 cents or something like that so it was a really good deal so i got two of those Okay, so the last thing that I got is probably my most favorite buy from Bulk Barn. Um, everyone knows Halloween's around the corner, and Halloween apparently is a really big deal in Canada. And it's my first Halloween. I've never celebrated Halloween in India um, because Kanju's auntie and uncles would not want to give me candy if I randomly showed up at their house. And anyways, I've never gone trick or treating. I have never celebrated Halloween, so I'm so excited to be doing Halloween. Um, right, so. To bring in the Halloween spirit, I got this really cute pumpkin-shaped candy like jar. Like I think you can put anything into it, but it's just this glass, um, this glass bowl that is shaped like a pumpkin. And I thought it was the cutest thing ever. So I want to put a bunch of my dry fruits and all my candies in here and keep it on my bedside because I thought that was so cute. and it's so like halloweeny that was basically my bulk bun video slash haul this was a super super impromptu video i just thought that um i was doing something new and i hadn't been there before and y'all hopefully haven't been there before hopefully this was something new and y'all like got to explore something with me but yeah since it was my first time at bulk bun and i thought since i haven't heard of bulk barn a lot of people wouldn't have heard of bulk barn and i thought i'll show you all around and show you all what bulk barn is and what it looks like and just haul everything that i got if you have any other video ideas that you all want me to film leave it in the comments down below and i will get to filming them i really hope you like this video i will see you in my next one